immediately to my right, the greatest footballer ever. And what a joy in Stoke-on-Trent and Britannia Stadium to be able to welcome the greatest footballer ever to our stadium. A campaign of the justice as well. Pele dedicated his thousandth goal to the poor children of Brazil. Archbishop Desmond Tutu. Any of us could go on for a long time. He's got a goal. <laughs> Do you know what I'm... Archbishop Desmond Tutu, he'll, he'll entertain and amuse us himself. But it's a great pleasure to have you here, Your Grace. And of course, the man who needs no introduction to any of us, a man who moved here to Stoke-on-Trent over 40 years ago, made Stoke-on-Trent the home for him and his family, the greatest goalkeeper ever, our club president, what this day is all about, our very own Gordon Banks. Colin Powell, Sky News. May I ask Pele, uh, that famous save of Gordon's, when uh, you met that cross with your head, you must have thought it was a goal. Yes, unfortunately, <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it's not serious. Uh, I think you have the tape. Uh, maybe in some some summer uh, tick, we go. You see, after I had the ball, after the cross of Jaya, I had the ball. I I already jumped to say go. Then I looked there. I did I did go. Oh. <laughs> because uh, no, the ball was uh, no to me was look was inside, you know. Then uh, but take the ball. The ball was outside from the. Uh, that's really I I, I was you know, close to shot goal, and, uh, but uh, I always went across with uh, with Bob because we walked to bat together in FIFA banks. Uh, then always I say, listen, I score more than a, a thousand goals in my life. People don't remember the goal, but the goal I don't score, they remember. <laughs> 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 but uh, I think that is a, this. This is the the football. This is something beautiful in the football. You know, the winner and the lost, they always are present, and they make people together. We are here today because of this. I think this is the most important thing in football. No? The membership. You know, the yeah. Well, it, it was quite an important save at the time because the score was nil-nil and uh, it was a very even game. It was, I think it was fairly early on in the game, but it was, it was an even game as, throughout the 90 minutes, if you understand what I mean, very, very close game. Um, so to make that save at that particular time, you know, it kept the, head, the lads' heads up and, uh, as I say, we went on to play an excellent game. Unfortunately, we did lose the match, but uh, we played uh, exceptionally well that day in in the sort of weather and conditions that, that really did favour Brazil, the, the very, very hard pitch. Uh, I think it was 102 degrees inside the stadium. Uh, and of course the crowd were, were, were behind uh, the Brazilian side because they'd done a great PR job before we got out there. <laughs> <laughs> How special is it for you today to have these people around to, to witness the... the oh, fantastic. It's fantastic. For, for these people to come all this way, um, it's, it's, it's really remarkable. And, uh, I do thank them very, very much indeed. Are you quite close to yourself and Pele now? Yeah, well, we, we bumped into each other like a, a few times, uh, for different presentations and things, uh, mostly here in, in, in England where I've seen, uh, I've seen Pele. But uh, yeah, we, 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 we always, uh, we've always had a very fun relationship with each other and uh, we, we, we have great fond memories as well. But we become a good friend and close friend that was in, in the United States. Yeah, and when they come to play there, we play as well. Yeah, Cosmo, and then there we get more friendship. And Gordon, um, Pale's already been asked if he thought his header was a goal. Did you? When I actually got my hand to it, um, I, I, 
I wasn't sure. It did look as though it was going to the top corner because now I'm breaking my fall on the hard surface. So once I've got my hand to reach back for it uh, and it's gone up here in that direction, I, I'm now falling on the ground. So I don't know where it's gone. And I really thought it might have been a goal. But the momentum of the save brings my lower part of my body around uh, and my head come round and I saw it bounce behind the goal and that, that's when I said, Banksy, you lucky brat. <laughs> <laughs> what uh, what we, we talk here is something about 40 years ago. No, 17 is 30, 38 years. About the World, the, the, the World Cup, one save. Uh, listen, what what the football put together and how many people going to be, you know, uh, look and hear what we say here. Then when you talk about peace, I think this is the more, more important. Because uh, I don't know if uh, a lot of uh, the, the young here doesn't know, but today, today, the, the biggest family in the world is the family of football. Because the FIFA has more affiliates than, than the ONU, UNESCO. Mm -hmm. Then the biggest family in the world today is the family of football. And everything we can do for peace, I think this is a very good impact in the world. It's one of the greatest saves. <laughs> Gordon, Gordon, would you sign you the scrapbook? The greatest save. Yeah. <laughs> Brilliant, thank you. And Gordon, Gordon's going to sign it now. Just this anywhere at all. Yeah, yeah, just anywhere. Yeah. Oh, Whatever you want. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's lovely. Can I ask you as well? Not really. Oh, well, I want you. <laughs> yeah. you, might not, you might not believe it. I, I'm, I'm actually quite modest with this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Give them a big round of applause. This is a great moment for Stoke on Trent, the Britannia Stadium. And our stars today, the two managers of the teams to be seen later on, ladies and gentlemen. Gordon Banks and Palais. The one thing he says, which is, which is, which is, I've heard him say this before and it's quite true, wherever he goes around the world, people talk about the fantastic goals that he scored and he scored quite a lot, believe me. But when he comes to England, all people talk about is this the same. <laughs> I just want to thank God to give me health to be here today to uh, represent all the players all over the world. It's a big responsibility, but uh, no doubt.
Today is a very, very important day for me, I think for the world and for the family of football. Because we have here, you know, one of the best goalkeepers in the world to be. That said, is the reason I told you, thank God to be in the house, to be here with, with you today. Thank you very much to all who make this possible, and thank to all of you who gave the love to me and my career too. Thank you very much, Banks. Congratulations. Thank you very much. That's Pele. They shake hands, they embrace on the stage, Pele and Gordon Banks. It's a fantastic piece of work of Gordon Banks holding the Gordon aloft. Banks Monument. The Jules Rimet Trophy in his right arm, and you don't often see statues either. A footballer is smiling, and Banksy is smiling with a Stoke City scarf round his neck. It's a magnificent piece of art, one right up there with our very own Sir Stanley Matthews, and it makes you proud. Gordon Banks standing in front of the statue of himself As in his own words statue, he said it's not often you get a statue made of someone who's still alive so I'm really pleased to still be here to see it Absolutely brilliant. 